Welcome back to the Yankees postseason preview, everybody. I'm Michael Kay, along with David Cohn and Paul O'Neill. It was certainly not a normal season, just a 60-game season because of what's happening around the world, but it was a 60-game season that Major League Baseball was able to get in. And we'll start with you, David. What surprised you about the Yankees' performance during the 60-game season? Well, there's so many ups and downs. I think just the 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 Jekyll and Hyde nature of their team uh, it really surprised me. Now, part of that is the injuries, and they've had a lot of injuries to contend with, and you can almost look at the streaks that they've had and, 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 and sync them up with the injuries there and judge at the top of that list. So, yeah, I mean, the injuries again, next man up, part two, and then just the wild swings between winning 10 in a row and then, you know, going 5-15 and 15 prior to that. Yeah, pretty amazing. They started out 16-6, and six, Paul, and then, as, uh, as David mentioned, 5-15, and 15, and you scratched your head, and they didn't exactly finish strong either. So what Yankee team is going to this postseason, and what do you worry about the most watching them during the 60-game slate? Well, the one thing that does scare me going into Cleveland now that it is Cleveland is you're facing Bieber. I mean, he is the Cy Young winner, and, you know, not too many people – can match up against Garrett Cole, but he can. Uh, you know, they're not a great offensive team, but they have been recently. They're one of the hotter teams in baseball. Does that show up next week, or do the Yankees show up and be the better team that they are? So, uh, you know, a lot of questions. We can sit and, and try to figure it all out, but until Tuesday night, you're not going to know anything. Well, the, the 